with joyful voices and happy hearts. Men of Nehemiah Abilene sing praises as this brotherhood battles through their addictions alongside founder Lee Morris. It's not something magical, it's a relationship, it's intimacy, it's uh, being transparent. The story begins when Morris hitchhiked over 700 miles to his first stop after a recovery program in Dallas. I heard uh, an audible voice that said to go to Colorado. And he had one more stop until he made it to Abilene. I didn't come straight back to Abilene. I actually went to Weatherford, Texas. During his time in Weatherford, where he says he learned the most and what brought him back home. I got involved with uh, Grace Community, their Celebrate Recovery program. I got involved with the local AA. And once he came to Abilene to start the recovery program, he met Jacob Pusateri, who was a past addict that recently finished the first part of the program and is now joining the staff to help others. Since I've been here, I've grown in areas inside me that I've never grown in, that I've never been able to push over that place because I, I would just run away. So now I have to face myself. The program began with two men and is now nearly 20 men and continuously growing. I know that all of that pain was ordained for this moment to relate to these men and, uh, and know and understand even if it wasn't that same pain, it was pain. The men of Nehemiah Abilene recently had six graduates go through the first part of the program. It's where I found true identity. And they hope to finish the year-long process this fall. Abilene, Monica Diaz-Meek, KRBC, Abilene's Local News.